The European Union has allocated just $2.5 million in aid for those affected by the eruption of a volcano in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Thousands of people who were ordered to evacuate the city of Goma last week say they're not getting any aid from the government. Hundreds of homes have been destroyed, but aid agencies now say the mass evacuation increases the risk of cholera. Well, David Masomo is the managing director of Manvuno, a DRC-based NGO that focuses on rural development. He says the government simply doesn't have the resources to handle such a mass movement of people. This situation is uh, really complicated because, as you know, the people was uh, evacuated in places where there is no uh, basic infrastructure, no water, no shelter, uh, no, I mean, there is no food enough. And mostly the government is a new government. So the government, first of all, is not capable of uh, taking care of these displaced people. And secondly, the eruption has not been informed before. So nobody was prepared to, 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 to take care of this situation. So that's how bad the situation is, just because people were not prepared People uh, they have not, they don't have enough infrastructure, and uh, that's the chaos that is happening. And I'm afraid because maybe even the disease can be, uh, you know, distributed easily. Something like cholera can happen in those camps where people are staying together without any protection and and uh, anything that is uh, helping them to be, I mean, uh, clean. So it. It's really a, a bad situation. It's, it's, a, it's a big crisis. I've been talking with my friends and family who, are in, uh, who have been displaced, and uh, they are saying that the government has not helped them at, at, at all. So there are only international organizations still the ones who have the, enough means to, to do so, but not local organizations because they depend you know local, local organization depend on international organization so uh, i think only international organization is still helping and uh, the government is not yet has no uh, not enough means to help uh, the population